What is up, my legends? It's your boy Sion. We are back and we are covering uh, Eloise. Now we have her maxed, and I'm gonna do a disclaimer right now because I know somebody that come in like Soyvig, Soyvig, Soyvig. Oh my god, Soyvig, Soyvig, Soyvig. Bruh, my channel, I'm gonna do what I want and I'm still gonna win. Calm down. So, with that said, Soyvig is better. She's just better. However, I don't want to use her. Like, it's boring. Like, she got, she probably is the most boring character in the game. So, I'm going to use what I want to use. You don't like that, and, you know, feel free to watch the Soyvig video that somebody probably did. But we're going to chill with Eloise. I think she's swag. Anyway, so, first skill, Daring Dash. Eloise summons three robots and charges towards the um, enemy, dealing 500% damage. Uh, robot soldiers remain in the field after the charge and the shield robots will taunt the enemies within 10 yards thus attracting enemies to attack them after taunting enemy the shield soldiers will grant teammates an energy shield that absorbs damage 30 percent of max health for three seconds refreshes and does not stack all right so here's the thing the higher that this goes more damage that it does which is good she's more lines of the dps type of thing and the higher your health is the higher the shield so to speak so if you actually put energy recharge on her she actually has a lot of uptime with this which potentially makes her really good actually especially the fact that it takes the pressure off the rest of the team so you don't need as much crazy shield uptime as you would possibly need. But if you have energy recharge, you're still going to have that shield uptime. So not only do you have more of a DPS option and a better looking character that's not boring as F to actually play, then this is fun. However, this now leads you to the, um, the thing that this has a lot of cost to actually make good. You need to actually make her strong to make this good. You need to put that HP high up there so the HP shield is actually high so she has a, a higher cost than soyvig and um she's harder to build obviously because soyvig is like a, a basic b type of character you can just upgrade and evolve and do all types of special stuff with her and scale it faster so is this worth doing only if you want to be different that's my opinion only if you want to be different but she's not really that far behind once you get to get her to a higher level just because of the scaling and what she has so going over here you have um boost damage of 40 percent and crit chance by 12 percent and i'm going to continue to use them i'm going to show you guys because i know people are going to be like oh my god this this that and the third and people don't think outside the box that practical use overrides tier list it just does and I proved this time and time again, time and time again on this channel over and over and over again. And it always happens over and over again. Somebody just come in, be mad that I'm not being a meta slave. And like, and I'll, over and over again, I'll tell them go to hell. So <laughs> like, it just happens. So anyway, um, passive skill on Knight's Honor. Attacking grants 20% chance to recharge 120% energy, which is actually really nice again this offers a lot of uptime again thinking outside the box like i don't see how this is a bad tank at all i don't see how this is not a high powered tank um, once you get her the proper gear to, to take advantage of that um passive skill shivery deals 30 percent damage to enemies below 80 percent health and 40 percent more to enemies below 60 percent health so she pretty much has a uh a executioner type of talent that's what these are um, typically called, where she just is going to do more and more damage to um, the lore that they are. Apply the damage bonuses and crit chance and crit damage to 10% when enemies are below 40%, which is actually really good. Um, evolution, we are not there for that. Um, and I have her at 5 or 6 right now. I'm probably not going to get this eye because I want to go back into saving again. I don't want to, um, you know, not have any type of currency for the next character, which is going to be coming up. And yeah, so that's where we are. And she has an amazing swimsuit. That's a, I, what makes this swimsuit so good. And I know you're probably like boobies and all that type of stuff. Yes, that's all the characters do that. So that's not that big of a, um, a craziness. 
is the fact that she still has the coat. She still has this coat. She pretty much has the coat like slack that like that that is that's sexy i like that that that's like i'm gonna look sexy like this but i'm gonna still have my coat i'm still gonna be a captain out here i'm gonna be a captain bad b i like that i like that this is a good skin and she's just a cutie right there like she's a cutie when they're cute and practical yes yes please come through i, I will represent you not that Soyvik is not cute. Soyvik is actually cute too, but she's derpy looking. So, so I'm like, I'm over that. Uh, so let's go in. And, and like I said, I am actually going to um, build her so I can show you guys exactly what I'm talking about. I'll also, oh, gear wise, let me show you something real quick on gear. We're not going to take too long in this video for this. Gear wise, what I'm actually doing is I put this on for her right now. So this is excellent for her. When the mech is on the verge of destruction, invincibility for six seconds. Um, this is really good for her. I had it on Soyvig. Um Soyvig is benched basically now, so I'm putting this on her. And again, the reason why I'm doing this, because no people might not understand why aren't you not using the meta, it's because she's meta and she's boring. Like, I just start, like, it, it's amazingly boring on top of that. Like, it, it, like, wow type of boring. I can't, I absolutely can't. Um, and I actually want to see if I can do the, uh, the runaway strat in that dungeon with her and see how it works with her, just to see if, if it's going to work. It probably will because it's the same type of character and her HP is not that far off from what Soyvix is and um, overall her mech is actually stronger so I should be able to do it and then you can see my crit chance and evasion down there and everything else. Uh, what I would like to do is I would like to get a chip that I can put on that has some type of accuracy but you can't really control that so. The next chip that I get that has accuracy on it, hopefully if it has accuracy on it, I'll put it on her. But I, like I said, I can't really control any. All right, so I took everybody out of the team and we're going to take the boss on by herself. I didn't want to make the video longer just to show that. Wait, why is everybody still here? Did I not? Oh. I'm still gonna make the damn video longer for no reason. Oh. What? Hello? What? Oh, it's just showing me last step. I was confused. Anyway, so we are going to be doing this solo. You guys can see. He actually does a lot of damage. And she has a good poke. Somehow, somehow her poke she misses mid-range. You can see what I mean. Like, like she has like a real a really weird miss. No, sir. None of that. Stop doing that. She's our special. Like, this is definitely more fun than Soyvig. Soyvig, I wanted to kill myself. <laughs> like, like, I hate this unit. Like, she's so practical, but so boring. And then she doesn't even have a mech. Like, I, like, I can't. I can't. That got me effed up. I can't use that character. Anyway, so... 
that is Eloise, um, maxed out and full. And she's a hell of a lot of fun to use. This is Mary, by the way. You get her skin for free. And I thought that she's chilling, so why not put her there for a little while until I get tired of it and go back to Aya. <laughs> so that's all I got for you guys in this video. Um, I'm going to be building up Eloise uh, and actually controlling her because the AI does stupid stuff with her. So like I, I just have to control her so they, they play properly. And then hopefully I get some evasion and energy recharge for her so she can actually be really nice with putting her shield out a bunch of time. And yeah. So I will see you guys next video. Be legendary and see you soon. Thank you legends for getting to the end of the video. We do three to four videos every day. Don't forget to like and subscribe and hit that notification bell so you can be first in the notification squad. I love everybody who stops by and I will see you next video. Peace.